So the first time I got to know you as a performer, it's a wonderful little film called Colors. Mm. Um, Colors is so important um, just in, in our culture, you know, like Dennis Hopper, mm -hmm. Sean Penn, your character of Rocket, your character was not, you know, one of the main characters was very central to the story. Um, can you tell us about the ex your experience on that film? That was wild. Um, that was one of my, f I probably one of the first movies I did. Yeah, mm -hmm. Hamburger Hill Colors, I think it was the second. Right, second Hamburger movie. Hill was the shit. Oh, thank you, man. Yeah, that man. was another wild experience. Yeah. But, um, so Colors, I had, you know, I'd moved to LA in 82 mm -hmm. to go to school, to go to CalArts to study mm -hmm. uh, um, acting. And From Kansas City? Yeah, uh, from, from Denver. Kansas okay. City, then Denver. Okay. Kansas City, Lincoln, Nebraska, Denver. Okay, yeah. and then, traveling man. Yeah, yeah. So I got this, you know, I, I moved out here and I really didn't know anything about the L.A. culture. Mm -hmm. When I, when I um, auditioned for CalArts, which is where I went to, to, to college, I stayed with my cousin in Pasadena mm -hmm. and uh, I came out and he was like, oh, you can't wear that blue shirt. Mm -hmm. I was like, yeah. what are you talking about? Yeah. <laughs> He's like, right. no, you can't. Right. They, they, they trip over the blue shirts and right. red, blue and red. I was like, you have got to be joking. <laughs> right. People don't care about yeah, what yeah. color shirt you got right. on. They're like, no, for real, you, you got to take that shirt off. Right. So I had that experience, too, coming to L.A. It's Me wild. Too. I you got don't... banged on. Oh, for real? <laughs> I live in a blood neighborhood, and I was wearing, like, this big-ass blood um, uh, red bubble coat walking down the street. It was my own fault. They were like, <laughs> who are you? What right. set you claim? You're like, no, I just like, like the no. jacket. They're like, no, nah, you can't right. just like the jacket. I just start cheesing, like, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> but uh so you know uh, i i kind of so when i did the movie mm -hmm. it was you know we it was i was steeped in cryptum and, and mm -hmm. bloodation and uh mm -hmm. it was uh day one <clears throat> i got in my wardrobe and you know i'm all blued out head to, head to foot and i'm sitting on this park bench and i'm just kind of waiting because we're getting ready to shoot and this dude comes walking by I'm just kind of looking at him, you know, like, oh, I wonder if he's an actor. Oh, no, he no. was not. He, he was, was not, not an actor. And he was not acting. <laughs> right. <laughs> <laughs> His name was J-Bone, okay. and he was for real. Mm -hmm. And he saw me, and I just looked back at him, and he started walking, you know, just me mugging me, just walking over to me. And I was like, damn, I'm supposed to be the leader of the, of the Crips. Crips. Mm -hmm. I can't get punked. Right. Day one. Right. You know? your fake game. Yeah, right. So I'm just, I'm like, wow, either I'm going to die or I'm going to, this is going to be a real interesting moment. Mm -hmm. So he just walked all the way up to me. He's like, what's up, cuz? I was like, yo, what's up? He's like, what set you with, man? I was like, well, what set you claim? I was like, I'm, I'm just an actor. He's like, mm -hmm. all right. I just want to see what the fuck was up. Mm -hmm. I was like, okay. And then he left. And I was like, wow, this is going to be a very interesting movie. Mm -hmm. Right. And then it became, you know, then as, as things went on, we were, we were shooting one day and it was, two, three in the morning, everybody's tired, punch drunk. It's the scene where we do the drive-by on right. the blood. And I'm supposed to tell him to shut the fuck up in the thing, right? Mm -hmm. So Jay Bo's sitting behind me in the thing, and we get ready to do the shot, and I'm like, man, shut the fuck up. And we cut, and he's like, shut the fuck up. You sound soft as fuck, man. <laughs> <laughs> sound like a punch, shut the fuck right. up. And so I'm like, no, we gotta do this thing for real. So then yeah. I was like, for real, Jay Bo, shut the fuck up, for real. Right. He's like, what? Like, I'll smoke you in this car right now. I'm like, I'm about to get killed on the set of a movie <laughs> wow. for wow. saying my lines as an actor in wow. a scene. Art imitating life. Yeah. Imitating uh, art, imitating yeah, life. Yeah, it was, it was bad. But so there were many <laughs> incidents like that because everybody, all the extras were really crips. That's how it was with Straight Outta Compton. They had real hood people on the set and you could tell the people that were actors and people that were actually from the streets. But how can you do that story without mm -hmm. having the real actual people of, you know what I'm saying? I mean, we've probably seen some where they didn't and they were like, yeah, that, don't, that doesn't feel real. Right. But yeah, we couldn't, I mean, it was kind of whack actually because they arrested him on some humble, on some mm -hmm. warrants or something that he had. And said, yeah, you can either, yeah. Mm -hmm. And they said, you can either be in this movie and get all your homeboys in the movie or you can go to jail. So what do you want to do? Wow. I, I heard that for the Ice-T video for Colors that that was all real gangbangers. Yeah, that's true. Probably, it is a real serious that culture, movie, obviously. That, that video plus that movie introduced visuals for gangbang culture to yeah. America, I think, for the first time in a real way. Yeah. Um, Dennis Hopper had a, like, an incredible vision um, for that. Uh, he went from Easy Rider to Colors. Uh, do you see parallels with those two movies? Um, I don't know. Dennis is a, is a very interesting guy, very interesting artist, uh, collector of art, mm -hmm. uh, himself a, a photographer, uh, 
R.I.P. Dennis. R yes, rest in peace, Dennis. Um, but no, I think he really brought a very interesting vision to the thing. And Sean Penn, mm -hmm. uh, as as the cop who we all hated on the mm -hmm. set, right? Because um, <laughs> really? he's always in character. <laughs> so he was Pac-Man for real. Up. Yeah, we hated it. <laughs> um, but. Uh, yeah, he he. Uh, he's still in character right now, running around right the world. Now. Yeah, he's still in character. <laughs> he ain't ever dropped it. Um, but yeah, it was just. Um, I think he brought a lot of those same sensibilities. You know, just his idea. And Haskell Wexler was the mm -hmm. DP, very famous. Uh, R.I.P. Haskell Wexler, mm -hmm. very important uh, cinematographer um, in the pantheon of cinematographers. So, yeah, Dennis just brought all of that, which was an interesting mix to bring that to that storytelling mm -hmm. and, and done that way. I always wanted to see the movie of the gangbangers, though. I was yeah. like, this is a cop movie, kind of. Yeah. I kind of want to see the gangbanger movie. Did you draw from the uh, people that were actually in gangs on set? Like, what kind of little mannerisms or things that you picked up from them? And oh, used? yeah. I mean, I tried to. I tried to. I mean, I always try to absorb mm -hmm. that stuff and, 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 you know, when you have the real people around you, it's obviously mm -hmm. something that you, I'm always looking and trying to steal things. But uh, it was, it, it, to, to, to peel back the layers and get to know them mm -hmm. as just guys and mm -hmm. not like, you know, gangbangers or whatever, just dudes, um, was really interesting and, and to hear their stories and to be accepted in. Mm -hmm. And then they were like, no, you, sh you know, you, if you want to like, dude, if you want to crit for real, I'm like, <laughs> <laughs> I'm, no, I'm good, right. I'm, I think I'm good. I'll right. just keep See, this acting thing world, going. That, that <laughs> happens in hip hop, but then they become crits. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> yeah, I was like, no. like, yeah, that sounds like a great that idea. Yeah, hilarious. let me gangbang. Yeah, I should totally do that. Yeah, no, I'm like, no, I'm straight. <laughs> I want, you know, it might be cool for a little bit. <laughs> mm, yeah, I'm not sure. They wanted me to do submissions like, cause you know, you, you do that whole Hollywood thing, you can get in places we can't really fuck oh, with, no. so you can, I'm yeah. like, nah, I'm just gonna just stay an actor if that's all right. <laughs> I'm just gonna, <laughs> that's I'm just gonna act. I just gotta act it. <laughs> <laughs> Get it, call me young, go get it.